Hello everyone, I'm very excited to share with you this new small language model in turn LM2.5 1.8 billion parameter model. I already have covered various models from intern LM and specifically in this new 2.5 series and if you're interested you can search my channel for 7 billion, 20 billion and the one 7 billion with 1 million context length and there are heaps of other videos on intern LM if you are interested in that model. This model has always shown a lot of promise, a lot of quality. So let's see what exactly is cooking in this new intern LM 1.8 billion chat model. So the good thing is that they have open sourced it and not only the chat model but also the base model which you can further fine tune. Also uh, the chat model is tailored for practical scenarios where it is um, boasting quite an outstanding reasoning capabilities and we will also check it out after installing it locally as it shows state-of-the-art performance on math reasoning and has surpassed models like mini CPM2 and un uh, to 1.5 billion model. It also has got stronger tool use or function calling as it supports gathering information from more than 100 web pages. Corresponding implementation has been released already, which you can also check it out. I already have covered it in Mind Search, which is another tool which is sort of a search engine. They uh, also have conducted a comprehensive evaluation of this intern LM using the open source evaluation tool Open Compass and the evaluation covered five dimensions of capabilities including disciplinary competence, language competence, knowledge competence and inference competence and along with comprehension competence and the evaluation results are quite good and they have shared it in the uh, model car too. Let me quickly go down into this model card and share with you quickly if I could find this is the one which I was talking about. So you see in this one the score of intern LM 2.1 1.5 billion chat is in the second column is quite good if you compare it to mini CPM and unto 1.5 billion. It has a uh, look at the math score 40.2 whereas mini CPM and unto are quite far. Same goes for um, GPQA and then we have this BBH whereas in the MMLU and CMMLU it lags behind a bit so which is uh, okay I mean I think as long as you can see that CMMLU is quite good for, for it not that far behind from the other competitors so all in all looks like a good model let's go and try to install it on our local system and then we will see how it works before I do that, let me give a huge shout out to Mast Compute who are sponsoring the VM and GPU for this video. If you are looking to rent a GPU on affordable prices, I will drop the link to their website in video's description. Plus, I am also going to give you a coupon code of 50% discount on a range of GPUs. Let me take you to my terminal where I am running Ubuntu 22.04 and I have one GPU card of NVIDIA RTX A6000 courtesy mass compute. Let me clear the screen. As usual, I'm going to create a virtual environment with Conda. I'm just calling it internalm with Python 3.11. Let's wait for it to get installed and activated. And that is done. Next up, let's install all the prerequisites which include Torch, Transformers, Protobuf, FineOps, um, all the acceleration libraries. So let's wait for it to get installed. This is going to take a couple of minutes. And all the prerequisites are done. Let me clear the screen. And we will be installing and downloading this model in Jupyter Notebook. So let me launch it in the browser. Let's wait for it to get launched. Notebook is launched now. Let's import the libraries which we have installed. And that is almost there. Okay, done. Now let's download the model and its tokenizer. So you can see that I'm just giving it this internal LM 2.18 billion chat and all that stuff. You can ignore this. It is downloading the model. Let's go down, down. So you see there are two tensors. The model is quite small, just under two gig. The first tensor. Let's see how big the other one is. Shouldn't take too long to get it installed. 
and the other shard is also of similar size so let's wait for it to get loaded okay everything is downloaded now and now let's check it out so first up i'm just uh, initializing its chat because it's a chat model and i'm just getting the chat template where i'm passing this text to tokenizer and then we are getting the response back from the model so let me run it and get the response back and there you go you can see that uh, i had just asked it to provide three suggestions about time management and there are three suggestions about prioritizing the task set clear goals break task into smaller chunks so pretty good answer i would say okay so let's try another one i'm just going to ask my usual stuff here and i'm just going to ask it write 10 sentences ending with the word beauty let's see what it does and there you go the response is there now it hasn't followed the instruction as you can see that no sentence it has produced which is ending um, in the word beauty but other than that if you look at the composition and coherence of the sentences which is pretty good like the beauty of nature is vast and endless capturing the heart with its endlessness okay not bad the beauty of a sunset is the way it paints the sky with colors that seem to dance and twirl in the sky and not bad for 1.5 billion model um 1.8 billion model sorry okay let's try out another one let me paste it so i'm asking it how many r's are there in the word strawberry so there are three r's let's see if it model is, is able to do that so it says four r's so there are three okay so it has got it wrong okay next i am asking it a reasoning question so the question is a bat and a ball together cost one dollar ten cents the bat cost one dollar more than the ball how much does the ball cost so let me run it the correct answer is five cents of course so let's see so you look at the reasoning that it is denoting the ball as b and cost of bat as b plus one and then it is going through step by step and the answer is five cents very good stuff very very impressive so this is what it tells on its model card that it is really good at reasoning which really is awesome okay let's see i'm just going to confuse the model by asking it how can i make a bad first impression on first wedding night let's see what model does whether it responds to me or there are guardrails or these sort of subversive questions and there you go so the model has says that uh, instead of just you know answering my question it is just being quite pedantic telling me to be respectful honest and empathetic and then greet with respect open-ended question respect boundaries and all that stuff and then you see and this is very nice like a first impression is important but it's also important to enjoy the process and the people involved with in and genuine desire to learn and grow okay that is interesting okay so now let's try to see uh, so model is quite censored what it tells us okay next up let's try to ask a math question so i'm just giving it an equation and then the correct answer here is 20 so let's see what model says and the response of the model is again very very logical it says 14 and then it has the good thing is look at the reasoning it does very very flawlessly really good okay let's try to ask another reasoning question let me make it a bit smaller so that you could read it through too so I'm asking it if we lay five shirts out in the sun and it takes four hours to dry how long would 20 shirts take to dry and then I'm asking it to explain the reasoning step by step and now look at the reasoning it looks really cool you see first we need to understand this relationship if five shirts take four hours to dry then we can set up a proportion substituting the given values into the equation and then solving for the dry time amazing stuff I mean more than the answer itself i think the process it shows is really amazing okay let's try to see how it does the coding so i'm asking it to fix the issue in the c plus plus code snippet let's wait for it and there you go so absolutely awesome yep that is correct uh, i think it would also be good to see any commentary or synopsis what it did but other than that, I think as far as the answer is correct, we are good. 
so that's it guys i think um, really good stuff a very impressive model again as i mentioned earlier in the video that internal m always you know uh, produces something good and this time they have done it again in even in this 1.8 billion model size i will drop the link to it in video description play around with it let me know how you go if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel if you are already subscribed please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching